Hey guys, welcome back to Total Tech. Um, today we're going to talk about how to make custom uh, short line commands for Ubuntu. Um, and what I mean by that is um, sometimes you just have a long command that you don't want to type over and over again. Well, there's actually a way to make your own custom commands that are kind of like abbreviations of it. Um, so before we get started, be sure to like and subscribe, and then we'll get into the video. All right, so if you guys remember from our last video, we installed something called Logo LS, and that kind of just made our um, terminal look super nice. So we can pull up Ubuntu here, and we type something like Logo LS. And it would, you know, show these nice icons. And we could do logo dash ls dash a, and you know that's pretty nice. Um, but honestly, this is kind of a lot to type. Like logo dash ls is a lot longer than just typing ls and ls dash lrp. So you know those are the shorthand. So how do we actually make this easier to use? Well, one way is that we can um, just edit our profile, and we do this by going bi into our profile. So we're right into our profile, and we're going to hit i for insert, and we're going to type this item right here. So let's zoom in on this. Okay, so if you look at this, um, our alias is ILS and that corresponds to logo LS. So basically what we're telling here um, for Ubuntu is that we're telling them, okay, we're going to use ILS as kind of a shorthand for logo dash LS. Um, and so when we save this, we have all these other commands like logo dash LS dash A, we can do ILA. And we're basically um, telling uh, Ubuntu that these are shorthand notations of this. Um, so let's do, uh, you know, a write for this. So if you look at um, this section right here, um, right here I need to, oh, yeah, right there. Um, this is for the get one. And then for here, if you notice that there is no spaces between the equal sign, we need to make sure that um, when you're typing this command that there aren't spaces between this first command and uh, the actual command that we're running um, because uh, Ubuntu doesn't really like that and it'll complain. So let's hit escape and then hit colon qw to write to file. Oops, sorry. Colon wq, that's the right order. And then we're gonna reload the file here. Sorry, reload the bash. And now when we type ils, um, it's gonna run logo dash ls. It's the same thing, but it's a lot faster. So if we do ill, you know, it'll run logo dash ls um, space dash a al so we can do this for pretty much any command so one really common command that we run all the time is you know we gotta update our um, packages for ubuntu so people typically run sudo apt update like all the time so we guys to do the same thing here so let's add this as a kind of um, a, a shorthand so let's do vi profile again and now to the bottom of this we're just going to add another alias and we're going to call this let's say upd for update and this is going to run sudo apt update and then we'll do another one for alias uh, let's say upg and we can call this sudo apt upgrade so now when we write this to file we can reload ubuntu again so now if i just write update and hit that command it'll automatically run sudo apt update and because it's sudo we have to type in the password and it'll update the packages and then i can do upg you know, upgrade the packages, yes. And this is basically how you add these really shorthand um, kind of updates and your own customizable commands, basically, for sure. Longer commands. So, hope you guys like that. I hope this is helpful. Um, be sure to like and subscribe and share with all your friends. Thanks for your time.